An example of the efficiency ratio is the payables turnover ratio. The payables turnover ratio formula is the cost of goods sold divided by the accounts payable. We use the cost of goods sold with accounts payable because both of them are costs. We get the cost of goods sold from the income statement and we get the accounts payable from the balance sheet. Please note that the income statement is a flow account, which means it is calculated over a year, while the balance sheet is a stock account, which is calculated on a certain day. Since we cannot compare a year to a day, we need to convert a day into a year by getting the average of the two balance sheet items. So, we will use one income statement and two balance sheets. In summary, anytime you find a financial ratio that includes an item from an income statement and an item from the balance sheet, you will use the income item and get the average of the two balance sheet items. So, we can rewrite the payables turnover as the cost of goods sold divided by the accounts payable average. Let's calculate the payables turnover for the year 2018. Cost of goods sold is equal to $30 million divided by, well, let's look at the balance sheet for accounts payables. Please note, in 2018, it is the first year of operations. Consequently, we do not have the average accounts payables as we do not have a previous year. We have the accounts payables in the year 2018 of $5 million. So, in our formula, we will divide by the accounts payable of $5 million, which is equal to 6. The unit of the payables turnover ratio is times. This means that the company pays its suppliers, on average, six times a year. The lower the payables turnover, the better. Next, let's calculate the payables turnover for the year 2019. Cost of goods sold in 2019 is equal to 38 million, divided by, well, let's look at the balance sheet for the average accounts payable in the years 2019 and 2018. We have the accounts payable of 15 million in 2019, and accounts payable of 5 million in 2018. So, in our formula, we will divide by the average accounts payables of open bracket 15 million plus 5 million close bracket divided by 2, which is equal to 3.8 times. The unit of payables turnover ratio is times. It means that the company pays its suppliers on average 3.8 times a year. The lower the payables turnover ratio, the better.